ran over to you, it appeared after that first touchdown. And I can't remember what Pettigian did he say anything to you or just like congratulations or something deeper than that? Uh, I think that uh, me and him just know uh, what recipe works for me. And he knows that uh, certain things that I need to work on that I've been really trying to focus on myself. And uh, just he gets a good kick and a good smile when I do it. And uh, it's awesome to be able to come back to someone like him and know uh, that I'm using the coaching points that he's given me to uh, make some progress. So, collect, so collectively, uh, I think it goes both ways on the front end. What are the ingredients of that recipe? Uh, I really think it's just uh, playing within my game. You know what I mean? Not um, just playing to my, my game, playing to my skill set, not trying to do anything that I, uh, not trying to be a hero. You know what I mean? Just play this game uh, the way that my body is built to play it and not trying to do too much. What, what has it been like for you from from the outside? You know, we see the two turnover plays, sure. and we're having, you know, we're talking about well, what does that mean for Tyler? And sure. After you've had had such a strong off season, did that allow you to have confidence to push through kind of some tough times here, or is it what's been going on in practice that's helped you, or what? Uh, I think it's just for me, just having a strong foundation in the first place to not let plays like that really drag you down too much. Um, obviously, uh, it's just a great lesson for life. You know I mean, sometimes stuff happens, and uh, unfortunately it's happened to me, and uh, you just put your head down and keep working. There's nothing you can do. Uh, there, you know what I mean? You can't go back, so there's no reason to dwell on it. You just keep moving forward and keep working. You said backbone that some of your teammates have given you. Yeah. Who besides Aaron has done that, and how much has it helped, even though you seem to be dealing with it pretty well on your own? Uh, everybody, uh, to be honest with you. Um, obviously, Aaron, obviously, huge deal from the tight ends. Sadie's, Bobby, Josiah, Alize, Sal, uh, Nate, all those guys have been huge. Um, and I just really just thank this whole team, honestly, because I could have told you the countless number of people that came up to me right after the play. Uh, defenders, players on defense, uh, everybody that just came up to me and just said, head up. Yeah, you know I mean, so it's really uh, speaks to the volume of um, uh, culture that we have here that when someone's in a moment of being down, that everyone's there to pick them back up. So it really just talks to the culture that we have here. Does, the day tell, does, does a day like today help at all, or you mm -hmm. don't really need that? No, I mean, anytime you could have a day like that, okay. I feel like it's definitely uh, you know what I mean, a beneficial thing uh, to kind of just spring me forward. Um, so I was excited to have a day. You know I mean? It's fun to – we play this game because it's fun. You know what I mean? And uh, obviously you never want those bad plays to happen to you, but you know that they're just going to come and uh, just take them with a grain of salt and move on and remember why you play this game. It's to have fun. I started playing this game when I was six years old because it was fun. So you really just got to get back to that and just play like you're six years old out there. You know what I mean? Have fun. That's the biggest thing.